An audit report released by the city of Brownsville claims the demoted fire chief was rerouting emergency calls to a private ambulance company. Those actions apparently cost the city thousands of dollars. Channel 5's Daisy Martinez attained a copy of the audit. She's live from the Cameron County Newsroom with more. The audit committee report looked at the time from December 2016 until September. In that audit, the report says during the time 78 emergency calls were rerouted to a private ambulance company, costing the city more than $62,000 in lost revenue. According to the audit, that company is Inner City Ambulance for Emergency Medical Transports. The audit states it was operating without the proper permits required by the city. It goes on to say both the previous Fire Chief Carlos Elizondo and current city manager Charlie Kabler knew about it. The committee was also unable to determine if the company had insurance, properly maintained vehicles or used authorized personnel. Concerns about rerouted calls to this ambulance company were brought to the attention of the city by Brownsville Police dispatchers back in December, according to the audit. It goes on to say each time the former fire chief was asked about the practice, he would respond by saying the city manager had allowed it and there was a need for a private ambulance service in the city. The city did not announce any ramifications against city manager Charlie Kabler, who remains on the job. We did reach out to the former fire chief as well, Mr. Carlos Elizondo. He declined to comment and referred us to his attorney, Noe Garza. Garza tells us they will not be commenting on this audit unless formal charges are brought against his client. Live from the Cameron County Newsroom, Daisy Martinez, Channel 5 News at 6.